All right, Jed's here with that bus stop oh. forecast. It's an exciting oh, morning for sure. Jed, good yeah. morning. Good morning to bus stop weather. Day number two for a lot of kiddos. 71 here this morning. Great start. You step outside, it, it has a nice feel to it. Feels very pleasant out there. Winter light. It's very nice. So enjoy that. But later today, like yesterday, the heat does shove back up into the 90s. We'll get back up to near 96 and throw on that humidity. Heat index will close in on 100. So make sure the kiddos are prepared, not necessarily for this morning, the afternoon does look quite hot here coming up today. Well, the first day of school was hot. Temperatures did climb back up into the mid to upper 90s again for about 95. Yukon 97 around Minko and the Norman area. So hot one yesterday and we'll keep that heat going as we look down the road here. Temperatures will nose up to near 100 here coming up this weekend. So really a great lake weekend. You know, we're now kind of getting toward the middle parts of August, going towards September. Those days to get the boat out and enjoy the lakes starting to wind down. So if you want to see a great lake weekend, it's coming up this weekend for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. As going to early next week, those temperatures really kick in up near 100, 100 plus, and we'll track a cold front that arrives on Tuesday. And that'll nose in. We'll see some clouds, some showers, and a few storms around coming up Wednesday. And then a few more opportunities coming up later next week, but temperatures should start to nose back upward after a little dip in the road coming up later next week. So we'll be watching for opportunities. Chances don't look as good as what we thought yesterday, but still the chances are there. We'll talk more about that as the coming days arrive for those chances of rain and storms. Right now, 71 here in OKC. Southeast winds at six. Very pleasant start waking up this morning. That's a view from our SSM health cam. Sun coming up. It'll rise here in the next 30 minutes. Come up over the horizon. That's looking down at I-40. Folks heading on in. We'll talk to Hannah and get the latest update on that traffic here in just a little bit. Right now, 73 this morning, 8 o'clock. 83 at uh, 10 o'clock this morning. Then 89 by noontime. We'll climb into the middle. 90s by 2 o'clock and hang there on through 4 o'clock today. As we check your temps, nice temperatures out there. 66, Alva. In at 66, 65 in Woodward, head up toward Grand Lake. It feels fantastic. 63 up that way right now. Fall time air getting a little closer to Oklahoma, but most of us are running in the upper 60s and low 70s. Like I said, afternoon heating back up. Looks like 90s will be the rural up and down the central southern plains into today. The heat does start to build. Watch for more 100s building over the central parts of the country as the cold front starts to slide down. That'll bring some cooler air to parts of the Midwest, but still hot to the central parts of the country. That heat does build down into Oklahoma. We might be close to 100 on Sunday. If we don't hit 100 on Sunday, we've got an opportunity to hit that on Monday as 100s line up from Waco all the way up to near uh, Lincoln, Nebraska. 104 for Great Bend and Wichita as that front moves down. Really pleasant conditions across the Midwest. And we're hoping this front will keep sagging south and bring that air to Oklahoma about next Wednesday. Highest day topping out most spots in the 90s, low 90s northeast, but most of us in the mid to upper 90s going into tomorrow. S a similar forecast might even touch 100 around Alva, Altus, maybe near Lawton, maybe near the Ponca area, Oklahoma City getting up into the upper 90s near 97. Now rain chances holding off and through this weekend, maybe a chance in far east Oklahoma for a while this uh, weekend, but really for the most part we're dry. And then we'll expect to see rain chances going up probably midweek on opportunity for some rain. Data kind of indicating maybe up to about a half an inch, a little better chance further to the east, further west, rain chance look less. So it looks more like a scattered event coming in as we go toward Tuesday, Wednesday. We'll keep an eye on that, see how it plays out. But cold front arrives and we'll drop in the 80s and low 90s coming up next Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. But some rain chances and some cooler temperatures back all the way after a hot forecast from Sunday to next Tuesday.